so for example for the 3 volt and 5 volt circuit you can find a power management okay like this and two mosfets here okay two mosfets here for the 3 volt to generate 3 volt okay and other two mosfets here okay to generate here 5 volt okay so for 3 volt normally we should have here a 19 volt this is the main power for the motherboard this 19 volt will pass through some capacitors ceramic capacitors or PF capacitors okay and then go to this MOSFET drain or source no problem so and then here we have source and then this is gate this is do dh drive high gate okay the source will be connected for example to drain of this mosfet and the source of this mosfet will be connected to the ground and here we have another gate this is the lower or the drive low okay then here we will have for example a PIF capacitor and then the coil and then we will get the 3 volt the same here the same here also here we have drain for example this 19 volt will go here also will power this IC this is V in here we have the 19 volt also so here we have source will be connected to drain of this MOSFET and the source of this MOSFET will be connected to the ground here we have as you can see this is the gate okay will be connected to this IC this is the drive now two here drive now one one okay here also we have another gate okay this is the drive high as you see two here we will have here a capacitor okay a chemical capacitor that is connected to the ground or even two chemical capacitor no problem that is connected to the ground and then we will get here five volt okay so this is the circuit diagram of 3 volts 5 volts power system okay the same always the same working principle